in this video we are going to discuss about mirror adder it is an improved version of the adder circuit uh, this uh, uh, for uh, for full adder we know that uh, the inputs are a b c and uh, some i can write it as uh, a plus a x r b x r c where uh, a x r b i can write it as p uh, so sum is equal to p x r c where p represent the propagate and uh, carry is equal to a b plus b c plus c a if i take the whole bar uh, i will get carry bar is equal to a b plus c of a plus b the whole bar so from the truth table we know that uh, a b c is the sum and the carry value so sum means uh, you need to add these three uh, bits you will get sum uh, if uh, if two ones are there you will get uh, carry uh, if uh, number of one is more than two you will get uh, carry is equal to one okay we know that carry inverse is uh, inverse of the carry if it is zero you will get one if it is one you will get zero okay so the scary generation circuit is worth analyzing uh, here um, uh, the first uh, thing is the carry uh, inverting gate is eliminated okay uh, next uh, the p uh, the uh, pdn and uh, puen network of the gates are not dual um, so if the propagate signal is equal to 1 uh, if the, this is uh, this four values are propagate value if the propagate value is 1 whatever the value of c is propagated to the carry okay so kill means uh, whatever the value of c if the carry value should be zero that is called as uh, kill so i can write uh, k uh, k is equal to a bar b bar okay propagate is equal to a x r b and uh, generate so whatever may be the value of c in the carry will be one so this is called generate so generate g is equal to a dot b so here um, for carry inverse i can write it as uh, this is the equation for the carry inverse based on this i have plotted on k map so you can see if the input is zero for uh, triple zero input uh, the output is one uh, for triple one input for triple one input the output is uh, zero likewise uh, if uh, double zero one uh, input is uh, output is one for one one zero one one zero the output is um, for 110 the output is 0 ok so uh, since it is like this I can draw for, draw it uh, like a mirror uh, mirror circuit ok so so what is carry inverse carry inverse is equal to AB plus C into A plus B the whole part so this is AB and uh, this is A plus B into C so if I draw it series means it is multiplication it is draw it in parallel means it is a addition so in the similar way you have to draw a b you have to draw it a b and c a c i you have to draw like this and b because it is a uh, since it is following in this uh, pattern this this pattern so you can draw it in a mirror uh, like a mirror okay so the rest of this the thing is uh, similar to the so that to that of uh, static adder so this is for some some also you can draw it uh, like a mirror circuit okay since i am applying the so you can see uh, i can write uh, some sum is equal to a b a x r b x r c so this i can draw it like this right
ஜீரோ ஒன் 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 ஜீரோ இஸ் ஏபிசி ஸோ ஸோ சம் ஐ கேன் ரைட் இட் ஆஸ் ஜீரோ ஒன் ஜீரோ ஒன் ஜீரோ so uh, you can see for triple in uh, triple zero output is zero for triple one uh, output is one so likewise zero zero one the output is um, uh, one for one one zero one one zero it is uh, zero for one one zero it is zero so i can draw the sum also uh, in the mirror circuit right so if you see why it is called this uh, this part is called a skill means if uh, uh, if a and b both are zero zero uh, the vd will pass to the carry inverse so carry inverse is one so what is carry carry is zero so if skill is uh, one means carry is zero so likewise if a and b is one one uh, carry inverse goes to zero so carry is one so this is called as generate so similarly for c is equal to 1 and if either a and b are is equal to 1 1 means uh, carry inverse is equal to 0 so carry is 1 so this uh, whole term is called as one propagate so likewise similarly if carry c um, similarly this is uh, if uh, c is 0 uh, uh, and if either uh, a or b is equal to 0 means we uh, carry inverse is 1 so carry is 0 so this is called as zero propagate so this is called as one propagate this one is one propagate okay so next uh, we need to uh so this uh, this uh, p mass and n mass are completely s- symmetrical and uh, you can see that uh, uh, this uh, c is very close to that of uh, the uh, c is uh, the c is very close to that of the output uh, of the gate and uh, we can optimize uh, uh, this transistor for uh, speed by Uh, by making this uh, c is equal to size of the uh, n mass is 3 and uh, this is uh, 6 so i can uh, uh, write it as 12 12 okay this i can write as 6 6 okay so now this is uh, for a and uh, for this one uh, for a and b i can write it as uh, 1 and 2 since uh, the two transistor in series i can write it as 4 4 Because like instead of one, I can write it as two two. So you know, this is for to optimize the speed. Okay. So from this, I can uh, tell the optimum the uh, fan out uh, in order to get a minimum delay is equal to two. And you can see I have used nearly twenty four transistor. So this uh, this shows uh, there is a reduction in the size of the on both the area and the delay so this uh, this sum circuit is similar uh, this is 1 and 2 so since the two transistor in series i can write it as 4 this also series i can write as 2 1 plus 1 is 2 right so since the three transistor in series i can write as 3 3 3 this is 2 so since the Three transistor in series. I can write it as six six six. Okay. So I hope uh, uh, this video will be useful for you. Thank you very much.